Liberia, the country of my birth, was founded by freed American slaves in 1822. There was this growing class of freed blacks and freed slaves here in America who had been freed by their owners under the proviso that they leave the United States and go back to Africa. Back to Africa movement is how Liberia came to be. My great, 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 great grandfather, Elijah Johnson, was on the first ship of freed slaves that traveled from New York Harbor in 1820. This country was set up in a very antebellum sort of way where the freed slaves and the freed blacks replicated a similar society to the one that they had fled from in the American South, except now that they were in Africa, they were the upper class and the native Africans who they'd met there became the servants and the help. In 1980, this two-tiered system exploded when there was a military coup. They overthrew and killed the president, President Talbert. They raped so many women who were married to, who were of the elite class. Liberia descended into this very horrible civil war that lasted for almost two decades. And Liberia went through this horrific, horrific period that finally ended in 2003 when Charles Taylor was driven out of the country. 2005, Liberians went to the polls to vote for what many say were the first really open and free elections that the country had had. Uh, Liberians elected a woman president.